Hey guys, Coach Cam here again in the gym and we've got some pretty amazing news that uh, gyms are actually allowed to open much earlier than we thought they were going to be. So it turns out that gyms are eligible to open as early as May 19th, which is this coming Tuesday. However, we will not be doing that and there's a few reasons why. Uh, I just want to first off say that basically what we're looking to do is not compete to see who's going to open first, uh, but who can actually have an effective uh, plan in place and to follow all the guidelines laid out by the health authority. So what we're going to need to do as a staff group is come together, make a cohesive plan that's going to be safe and effective for you as members as well as the staff members. And we don't want to rush into that. We don't want to you know, cram all that stuff over the weekend and make mistakes. And I think that gyms that are looking to open up too soon are likely going to be making mistakes or they're not going to function as effectively as they could. So what we're planning on doing is having a meeting next week, early next week, and we're going to discuss all the options for opening the gym, scheduling, uh, programming, and uh, all sorts of stuff that's going to happen. And then we're going to be releasing that information to you guys. So we're kind of going to, kind of going to go in a step-by-step -step process. First thing, we're going to all gather and make sure the coaches are on board, all the staff members are on board with what we're going to do. Then we're going to move forward, tell you guys what the plan is, and then we're going to initiate that plan. And part of that plan is going to require getting the equipment back, because basically as I'm standing here right now, we have some medicine balls, a few really heavy kettlebells, and obviously the pull-up bars, but that's about it. The other thing is that cardio machines, the assault bike in particular, is not a great option um, for sharing space with other people. As Physio Greg was telling me early on, he said, you know, uh, the assault bike's basically the perfect dispersal mechanism for people's uh, breath vapor and sweat droplets and all sorts of stuff. So, um, you know, I think we've got to be cautious with that the use of those things and we, we won't be using the assault bike or the rower, uh, rowing machine right when we get back either just to make sure we're not sort of spreading everything all over the place. You can disinfect bars all you want, but even one person on a salt bike can actually pollinate the whole gym with whatever they've got in their lungs. So, something to think about. Um, the other thing is, you know, a few likely scenarios. The first likely scenario is that we'll go back to a programming system where we're actually uh, doing the same workout on consecutive days, and that will help, you know, disperse the membership over a couple days so that we can have um, enough space in the classes to allow that two meter distance and we'll also be basically segmenting the membership in that regard uh, either over Monday Wednesday Friday group and Tuesday Thursday Saturday group or possibly more groups than that if we feel like we're not offering enough in terms of those classes then we might look to support with some outside classes as well as some zoom for people who don't feel comfortable coming into the gym even though we have these procedures in place. So, just to tell you guys, I know you're super excited, I'm super excited as well. We can't, we, we're not, we're not, not we can't, we are not going to open on May 19th. Um, we are gonna take a sensible and cautious approach and that's what's gonna win the battle in the end and allow you guys to come back feeling comfortable and have a, and us have a nice system, efficient system, so that everyone's safe has fair access to the facility, and uh, we're providing you the excellent service that we, we, we feel we can offer to you at, at CrossFit City. So stay tuned for more information. Sit tight. Uh, we didn't come this far to only come this far. So just got uh, you know maybe one or two more weeks to, to, to wait, and uh, then we'll get you guys back in here. So keep fit and have fun. Stay healthy too.